Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is uh, episode 66 of Mountain Blade Warband, and we are cont we are actually, or I should say we, rather, Batania is actually being, uh, whoa, Batania is actually being invaded by both uh, the Sturgeons and the... Um, the Sturgeons, this is Batania, so we're in the middle of Batania. So they're being, they're fighting the Northern Empire and Sturgia. So Northern Empire is taking Karbanseth, while uh, Sturgia is trying to take uh, Pandrake uh, Castle. Now, what I am eyeing down here, I think maybe we might want to, uh, to preserve uh, or powder in in other words uh, Right now, I think we might be in, okay. Let us save this so if uh, The Northern Empire takes over car Bunseth, uh We should go and step in and take it over right? Okay, let us save. Yeah, we have I think we'll save it here. Let's save it on On 21 and then Let's see if we can take on Veron Castle. Veron Castle is a Batanian culture, but it has been in uh, Valendian hands for quite a while. And I think the Valendians currently are at war with the Western Empire. And so let us check on the, on the Valendians. We have never declared war on the Valendians yet. Uh, so Delfter, yes, they are currently at war with the Emp and the Aserai. Oh, yeah. Okay, they are fighting a two-front war. So it's a good. I think so. They're yeah. If they're yeah, they are. Oh, this is. I think isn't this the Western Empire? No, Valendia is. Oh, okay. The Valendians are down here, so they have, yeah, okay, so they are currently at war, so their efforts are down here, so uh, they should not be paying attention to uh, this thing that, uh, Veron Castle, so it's just a tiny castle up here, and if we look at it, it has, it has 38 uh, defenders, and 40 of them are wounded. Whoa, that means that means they were recently uh, they were recently what do you call this uh, besieged. So uh, maybe that explains why. Yeah, okay. Let's see. Anyway, if, if it doesn't work out, we can always uh, uh, backtrack. Or if we find out that Pendrick Castle and Carbanseth are better opportunities because we don't have that many troops and so again what we will do is let's do the sneaky thing again uh, given that hold on if we check on our main character we will see that our we our charm is so high look at our charm our charm is out of this world look at this so we can uh, I think our high charm allows us to be able to pay off um, right this is hold on yeah this is yeah Valandian oh no uh, we have to fight the Valandian first uh, is this what uh, clan because we cannot take it on unless unless we beat up on some Valandians right who's this guy this is that's a caravan and then this is Oh, Valandian. Oh, oh, look at this. Okay, that is a huge party. So we are not at war with them. So therefore, okay, we cannot... Caravan. What if we... This thing is going at four... Not good. You know what? Let us shadow these guys for a bit. Right? Asl because we can... I don't want to 
take on villagers. I will take on. Um, this is Golarin. Valandian Culturist Empire. Oh, these are huge armies. Yeah, let's shadow them for a bit. What's this? This is. Varon. Oh, why are they. Why is he all the way out here? What's the speed these guys are going at? This guy at 3, and this one is at 2.3. So we can always skip and run. Okay, how about this guy? Uh, Clan Gilman of Valandia. Okay. Oh, who's this guy? No, let's take this guy. This guy is only 33. What? No! Yeah, because uh, I think... Yeah, they, let them keep going south, so... Uh, Is this Western Empire? Stop there, stranger. I bid you. I am Thais. As far as I know, we have no contract to fight with you. Perhaps one day we shall see each other on the battlefield. You shall know the gilman of the splendor of our by the splendor of our steeds and the shimmer of our steel. Uh let's see, okay, what what is he composed of? Uh With the Gilman, <laughs> you really, it's decreased by ten. With De Maroc, does that make us go to war with Valandia? Are we going to war with Valandia, or are we just dealing with the? Uh, I think this is a minor tribe. If that's the case, then I think. Uh, You know what? Give them hell! Yeah, we'll just swamp them. <laughs> Who's that guy? You got hung up in a tree. I shouldn't say that because I will get myself hung up in a tree too.
Uh, cavalry. Are we at war with Valandia or no? <laughs> if not, I'll just have to reload the game because uh, <laughs> uh, we don't want to get to war with a minor clan and then they'll come and loot in, um, our, what do you call this? Our, our farms and stuff like that and it just makes it very complicated. So are we at war with Valandia? Yes, we are at war with Valandia, okay. Now let's see if we can actually survive this fight. Where's this guy? So how many? Oh, there are now 83. Oh, the battalions in the Northern Empire. Color Dog has decided to make peace with the Northern Empire. They were the ones. Oh, maybe I think they just took over. Oh, if they just took over uh, that big castle town, maybe we don't want uh, to take this one on because. We have only limited soldiers. That's ourselves only, right? Okay, lead the assault. <laughs> that is, again, we are being very opportunistic here. And I think um, then hopefully we pay somebody and then uh, we have the money anyway, so uh, I love smithing. Smithing gave us all that kind of money uh, that we can now be very free with it. Or uh, in the last two castles that we paid off for, like uh, Tolheim uh, or Flintog, Flintog and Rentoil. Uh, we just paid, I think Rentoil we paid 100 bucks and uh, Flintog we paid a buck. Okay, we don't want anybody. Uh, yeah, we don't want anybody. Who's this guy? No. It should be just one group, right? Yeah, just one group. Yeah, just one group. Okay, and then how about... Uh, Everybody else, that's one group. How about these guys? 84 soldiers, yes. Troops! Charge! Yeah, there's only 83 of them, so... Uh, Ouch. Let's come over here. Behind a wall. Get off our horse. No, people are dying. How come we cannot get the ladder? Ouch.
Au, 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 au. We died. A lot of our people died. Jeez. Wow. Oh. Nope. Did we get it? How many died? Ten people died. Ouch. Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, well, let's get everybody. Okay, then we can put them in prison, or we can garrison it up, right? <laughs> okay, we were able to... S okay, hopefully... Uh, no, we'll show mercy. Prosperity is, is 18. Party morale change. Minus 15? Why? Uh, go to the dungeon. Go to the garrison. Ouch. Uh huh. So we only brought two sets of people. The uh, the the Fian champions and the knights. Wow, we oh wow, geez, okay. Um, hmm. Okay, how are we doing? And then we can go to the prison. Uh, the, to the dungeon. Manage the prisoners. Oh, they can only contain uh, 40 prisoners. Okay, uh, if that's the case, let's bring back up the people that we want to hold on to. 57, the Vigla recruits. And uh, eight more guys, Imperial Recruit, no, Militia, Militia Archer, Crossbowman, okay, okay, that should be fine. And then let's go to... Uh, Let's go manage the castle. Mm. Okay, we are Botanian and um, we can improve on games.
No, no, we're not going to do any of these. Um, let's just improve on games. I, I mean, yeah, festival and games. Right? Okay, um, let's go to the stash there. Uh huh, what else? Some beer. Some meat. There's some variety. <laughs> so at least some variety for them. And then grapes. And fish. Yeah, at least they have some variety. Okay. Let's save this. Save as. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see if Carbanset has been taken over. Let's save it at 22. What are these? So we are at war with the Valendians, and this is a offer for new owner of Veron Castle. Yes. Who is this guy? No, we should not leave the castle. We can wait here for some time. Wait, who is this what war? Clan Gilman. You know, let's go to the garrison. Let's drop off most of the recruit. Uh, Fian champions. And then let's get the cataphracts in. The banner knights. Any of the horses. So that we are pure uh, cavalry. Okay, let's save this. I don't know if this guy can represent the Valandians. Right? Because uh, he is part of the... He is like, they work for the Valandians. They are a minor clan that is under vassalage with the Valandians. Or maybe working as mercenaries for them. And I wonder if they can, um, can represent the Valandians for peace treaty. What's the speed? The speed is 5.1. What's our speed? 5.5. Okay, we'll catch him. Especially in the woods. Uh, 
I wish you peace and prosperity. Our realm should make peace. Oh yeah, okay, so they are indeed, we cannot, uh, they are mercenaries, so they cannot, uh, they cannot answer for their lord. Okay, anyway, uh, I guess this would be a good place to cut the episode right here. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you join me in the next episode. Horse archers! Bye!